up next, it's a women's bantamweight matchup between Rowdy, Ronda Rousey, and Sarah McMahon. Sarah McMahon, making her way to the octagon with just one goal in mind, and that is to become the new UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion. As she makes her way to the octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape, she is focused, she is motivated, and she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. Sarah McMahon enters the octagon wanting to leave as the new UFC Champion. to medal in judo in the Olympics. She earned a bronze medal in 2008 in Beijing at age 21, and now is considered by many the most dangerous unarmed woman in the world today. Ronda Rousey was a bronze medalist in the Olympics in judo and has one of the best arm bars in the history of combat sports. Ronda Rousey enters the octagon for our main event of the evening. Our tale of the day for this bantamweight championship fight, Rousey is 29, McMahon is 35. Rousey will have a two inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, the referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. This woman is a wrestler with a professional record of nine wins, three losses. She stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Gaffney, South Carolina, presenting the challenger, Sarah McMahon. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, one loss. She stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion of the World. The fighters touch gloves, and we are set for this highly anticipated matchup. Man, we've been waiting a long time for this fight. Here we go! Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for McMahon. Black trunks for the champion. Ronda Rousey has some of the best judo in all of mixed martial arts. Some of the best armbar technique I've ever seen in my life. And on top of that, her overall mixed martial arts game gets better every day. Nice combination. She's mixing things up. Beautiful leg kick. Now we have ourselves a fist fight. Nice job avoiding the leg kick. This place is... Oh! oh! She is hurt. She is in big trouble. Oh, beautiful combination. Turning into an all-out slugfest. Big hooks. 
Swing and a miss. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Huge kick. A big shot to the head. Looking for the single. Nice leg kick. Looking for the single. Trying to close the distance. Back to over under control. Beautiful leg kick. Double underhooks. She gets to her back. Look at this, takedown. She's in half guard now. Good control, postures up. Rousey gets hit with the kick. Oh, nice body kick. And another. Nice overhand by Rousey. Joe, you can see coming in that the game plan was for her to throw late kicks over and over again. Oh, and she said that. Wow. She's not down. Big hammer fist. Final seconds of the round. Nice big knee! Big knee! Wow. <laughs> round one is in the books. Big shot at the end of the round, Joe. That looked very close to being declared a knockout. Yeah, that was a beautiful shot. I think a few more seconds and it would have been over. Let's take a look at some of the action from that round. Big power on this punch and results in a knockdown. Here's a devastating knee that lands and causes the knockdown. And let's look at that from another camera angle. The beautiful Brittany. The battle continues, and the champion is being pushed to the brink. The top contender looks very good, very calm, very poised, very determined to leave with the belt. That bruise on her outer thigh is really starting to get nasty. Checked by Rousey. Big swing and a miss. Missed on the takedown attempt. We go inside the numbers. Total strikes landed so far in this fight. Rousey with a kick to the body. Oh, Big that's power a huge that hook. Inside leg kick. Tried to throw that elbow. Very nice leg kick by Rousey. Just over two on the clock. Hard hook. Man, she is taking some punishment. Her left eye's really starting to close up. And she scores a single leg takedown.
Nice kick. Oh, that's a great block of the punch. Nice leg kick. She's done a great job with the leg kick. Over and over. And partner, these have been nasty. Trying to get a single. And she finally gets the takedown. Joe, she's been looking for it throughout this fight. Great movement on the ground. Final seconds of round two. They have fought for 10 minutes. That's the end of round number two. Here's a powerful knee that lands and causes the knockdown. Here's a powerful leg kick. Here's a perfectly placed leg kick. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. The beautiful Ariani. Here we go, third round, you ready? You ready? Let's go! And we are set for the start of round three. This is a championship fight, so it is scheduled for five. They clinch up here. And right into the Muay Thai clinch. Oh! Big knee! Oh, Lands a hard a shot to the left. Oh! Oh, this fight's close to being stopped. Vicious ground and pound. Big punches. Wow, right. look at that. That's it. it TKO. It was a vicious TKO from ground and pound strikes. Once again, here's our fight replay. Let's take one more look at the end of the fight here. This is a vicious series of strikes, ground and pound, that lead up to the TKO. We can see it here from another look. These are clean shots that are getting in over and over again, ground and pound for the TKO finish. And let's look at that again. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 55 seconds of round number three. Going the winner by TKO. Ronda Rousey remains the UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion. What a great night of fights. For my partner, Joe Rogan, this is Mike Goldberg saying so long until we see you next time inside the Octagon.